Arriva started in the 1930s with an individual setting up his own motorcycle repair shop. It then actually developed into a motor retail business, but then in the last 10 years it has reinvented itself in the passenger transport market. We have 15,000 buses, 400 trains providing services across nine countries in Europe. Our key objective in terms of our corporate brand is that safety comes first. Now, that is predicated on good risk management, good risk control, looking after the employees, looking after the customers, making sure that when people get on a bus, they get on a train, they can get on safely, they can enjoy the experience. Probably the most important challenge that Arriva faced was mature markets in the UK and Italy. Markets were dominated by one or two insurance companies. We're a very well risk managed business and we didn't feel it was being reflected in the premiums that we were being quoted. When you're looking to uh, win business, I think what you have to do is be patient. Two or three years ago, Arriva did a review of its insurance program, but also its advisors. Um, we'd been very happy with the incumbent advisor who'd advised us for many years, but part of that process was the introduction of Marsh. We weren't successful in 2004 at a point in time where we were asked to present on a particular basis uh, of coverage or strategic ideas. But as I took my advice from them and said, you know, you've got some great ideas there, hang in there. Marsh demonstrated their listening skills early on in the process. It's very important to Arriva because we are not just a UK national operator. We operate in, in nine countries across Europe. Each one is different and it begs different solutions. We came with a completely different perspective and came with the, the idea of, well, how are you managing risk? And isn't there a better way of doing this? Because we think there is and how about these kind of ideas and what about these kind of solutions and we just kept coming at them. And we felt that with Marsh what we were actually getting was the organisation. We weren't just buying an individual here or an individual there, we were buying the whole package and that was one of the key things that, that attracted us to Marsh. I think one of the, the things about Arriva was not giving up. And the key concept that they introduced that excited us was the concept of the direct writing captive. It was a shift change um, and they were going to have to take this leap of faith um, in Marsh and our capabilities and our ability to deliver. And then what it comes down to at the end of the day is trusting the people that you're working with. Working with a Marsh client executive team uh, is a straightforward process. Um, they, they understand our business, they're responsive to our needs but that understanding is not just in this office here in London, it's also in Germany, it's also in Spain, it's also in the other territories. So they have been able to feed through out of this office to their satellite offices where we operate the same uh, approach and the same concerns and the same attention to detail that we need. We had to convince them that we were doing the right thing, and that we, but we believed in it. And I think, you know, that comes through um, in the team and the whole team that we're working on this. We believed that the solution that we were giving to them um, or could propose to them was a, was a winner. A number of benefits have accrued from being in a direct writing captive. The first one is the speed of action. We're a growing business operating in new markets across Europe. We can make decisions quickly to put businesses on cover that we acquire or for new tender opportunities we can price competitively. That should give us competitive advantage and help us grow our business successfully. I mean, what I know for certain is that the relationship that Arriva and Marsh have established works. It's a mutual relationship. They want to hear what we've got to say. I want, a, I want a client that's going to be there for years. It's been a journey, an education for us, working alongside Marsh, who've guided us well through this process. And if we keep doing it this way and keep, keep um, playing to the top of our game, it's going to be a great relationship for many years to come. <laughs>